So while doing my research for this episode of Fun Type Facts, I came across a very disturbing uh, fact about voice assistants, the technology that's slowly being embedded into our digital lives. And I thought to myself, hell yeah, this is totally what I'm going to be talking about today. So for this episode, we're going to be unearthing some, um, let's say, interesting facts about voice assistants. Let's go. Before we get started, here's a quick word about Good Deals by KLGG, our official e-store. You can buy all sorts of awesome gadgets here at great prices, plus free shipping, and you can also get 10 ringgit off on your first purchase with a minimum spend of just 100 ringgit. You can also pay via 0% installments for anything at least 100 ringgit for up to 3 months via IOU pay. Visit the link in the description box below to start shopping now. Fact number 1. Voice assistants are constantly listening to you. <laughs> but not really in the way you're thinking right now. Um, as some people already know, voice assistants need to be activated by a voice command so they are constantly listening to a phrase or a word that wakes them up. So maybe it could be Hey Google, Hi Siri or something like that. And although your mic is constantly turned on, rest assured that your voice assistant technology or app isn't made for listening and recording your voice. And this leads me to fact number two, which is how voice assistants have been known to go rogue before. Alexa, turn off. And although voice assistants are only activated by your voice and your voice only, it's not a system that is foolproof um, because voice assistants have been known to uh, be activated accidentally by uh, misinterpreting uh, noises and sounds around you. So as an example of this happening, uh, back in 2018, a Reader's Digest article reported that a family who owned one of these machines, I think it was an Amazon Alexa, uh, they were having a conversation at home. Meanwhile, while that was happening, the uh, machine that they had misinterpreted what they were saying as a wake-up word. It could have been something along the lines of Alexa or uh, Good Morning Alexa or Hi Alexa and it activated by accident and it started recording um, their conversation by accident. While doing so, it again, through a, a series of mistakes, it interpreted the family as saying send message. So basically what happened was it was recording whatever conversation they had, ended up sending that conversation as a message to a family member in their address book. Now this issue of course being embarrassing is also potentially uh, harmful depending on what the conversation was. Now imagine your private conversations being recorded and sent to someone you know uh, without your knowledge and that is a huge problem. I felt invaded, like total privacy invasion. Like uh, immediately I'm like, I'm never plugging that device in again. I can't trust it. And this leads me to my third fact, which is how voice assistants are constantly recording you and there are actually humans listening. But let me explain, every time you make a request or command to your voice assistant, it keeps a log or a history of the things you say to it. All these can be accessed within your device itself. Now, all this data is actually being sent to the employees that work for the brands that own these voice assistants. Well, our engineers went through all of your logs they saw exactly what you told us, exactly what you said what happened, and we're sorry. Now the reason for this is so that the employees can actually look for keywords and basically make these voice assistants better and uh, more efficient the next time around. And it's more effective at listening to what you're saying and they can provide you with uh, relevant data. And the good thing is, these transcripts that these employees get are not tied to your name, they're not tied to your personal information whatsoever, so you can rest easy knowing that there is a layer of privacy there, but it's still kind of disturbing knowing that there are actual humans who know what you are asking your um, voice assistants to figure out or to Google. I don't have an opinion on that. Now the reason why I'm bringing up this fact is because um, convenience, uh, especially nowadays, convenience and, and improving software comes at the cost of uh, a little bit of your privacy and it's something that we have uh, grown accustomed to. If you own a social media account, your privacy is basically gone. And um, they use this so that they can improve their softwares, they can improve their offerings so that the issues that I mentioned in the story earlier doesn't happen as often. 
So that's all the fun facts I have for you today about voice assistants. Let us know what you think down in the comment section below or if you have a suggestion for topics you want us to cover for our next episode, let us know as well. Until next time, this is Victor signing off. Bye-bye.